I can't emphasize enough that the real goal here is to transition our thinking from the old model of medicine and biology to something that's really different and hopefully not just different to be different, but different because it's actually true or more true, more realistic than the old model. So in the old model, the, uh, the doctor's job was to find your diagnosis and then look in the book or have memorized what the treatment for that diagnosis is. Uh, and inherent in that way of thinking is that the diagnosis is somehow a reality. It is an actual, uh, you know, phenomena, let's say. The, the truth of the matter is, you know, most of these, quote, diagnoses are syndromes. And not only do they have many different causes, but they don't, they don't ever form, they're not like true pictures of what's happening. You know, one person with cystic fibrosis dies in their teens and the next one lives a fairly normal life and, and you know, at least until their 40s and 50s. So the question, is that the same disease? One person has a diagnosis of rheumatoid arthritis following a, you know, flu shot, which I've seen. Uh, and another person has a diagnosis of rheumatoid arthritis basically because of nutritional deficiencies, particularly collagen ingestion. So the question again, is that the same disease? And is it actually even worthwhile treating that as a uh, treating the disease? Or as I've said over and over again, um, is it actually more realistic and more effective because it's actually the more cl closer to the truth to treat what actually happened to that person. 